my name is Ewan Lindsay and I'm the Foundation Professor of Engineering here at Charles Sturt University. Today I'm going to share with you a bit of an insight into the vision for engineering here at Charles Sturt University, what we're trying to do, how we're going about it and our overall vision for CSU Engineering. There are a number of reasons why Charles Sturt University decided to introduce engineering degrees and most of them come back to the motto of the university, for the public good. Engineering is a profession that does a lot of good for society, but we often do it in invisible ways. People take for granted the fact that the water that comes out of their taps is drinkable. They take it for granted that their roads will work together, that their cars will function. In fact, you take for granted that you can watch this video without any real dramas. But the reality is they're all feats of engineering. But when engineering is done well, it's invisible. The reality is that if nature didn't make it, chances are an engineer did. The problem that we find out in the regions is that most of our engineers are trained metropolitan, they want to work metropolitan, and it never occurs to them to go out, in our case, past the Blue Mountains and look for work. And yet there's a substantial number of Australians who live out in the regions. Half of Australia's food is grown in the Charles Sturt University footprint, about a third of its minerals are extracted. And these are industries that require engineers, require talented people to come and help make them work. And it's very difficult to get people to come out here and do that. And as a result, regional communities struggle a little bit. When our new Vice Chancellor took office three years ago, the number one request he got from the mayors as he went around to visit and meet them was, when are you going to start an engineering program? And so the answer to that question was, when we come up with an idea that does justice to doing it properly. We didn't want to just come up with an ordinary everyday program and just put it in the region so we could. We wanted to come up with something unique and distinctive. And we now find ourselves where we have that we find ourselves in a position to train engineers out in the regions for regional conditions. Um, and to train and to work as an engineer in the regions gives you a whole lot of skills that are transferable back to a metropolitan context as well. But to work in the regions is very different. And so now we find ourselves with a great idea and the chance to train engineers to come and do that public good out in the regions. The most exciting thing about CSU Engineering is that we're starting from a blank page. Well-established engineering schools have habits, they have processes, they have things that they've been doing for many, many years that lock them into old practices, and in many cases, outdated practices. We don't have that. We're free to look around and find the best aspects of engineering education and bring them together in the one place. And we don't have to work out how to get from the old ways to the new ways. We can just start with a program that does things that we know that work can start with the industry engagement that allows us to place students in industry, can start with the online learning approaches that we know allow more flexible asynchronous delivery, allow the students to learn at their own pace and adopt a mastery learning approach where they learn something, know that they learn it and then move on to the next topic. We can hire engineers in residence rather than just having purely academic careers for the people who teach our engineers. We can do all these things because we don't have the baggage of that's not the way we've always done it. And the most exciting thing is that we can do this, that we can build it from the ground up. But most importantly, the most exciting thing is the way that the CSU community has jumped on board this. They haven't looked at it and said, oh, that's a bit different. They've looked at the totally different vision we have and said, that is the right answer for CSU engineering. So I think the most exciting part about it is the way that people are embracing the difference, embracing the opportunity and getting on board that bandwagon as it rolls on.